Moscow's trace in Hamas' attack on Israel clearly visible, expert. The military training of Hamas militants who attacked Israel could be provided by instructors from Tehran and Moscow. The Russian trace in this attack is clearly visible. Alexander Musienko, head of the Center for Military and Legal Studies, said this on the air of Ukrainian radio. The military training of Hamas, which launched the attack on Israel, could be provided by instructors from Tehran and Moscow because the Russian trace is also clearly visible here through Iran, directly through possible financial assistance for Hamas from Russia. If we take Iran in this chain, if Israel decides to launch strikes on Iran's military facilities, which, for example, produce ballistic missiles that can be supplied to Russia, then Ukraine may also have an interest in this. This is our common interest and unifying factor, Alexander Musienko said. At the same time, the expert notes the nomenclature of weapons in security assistance packages for Israel and Ukraine coincides by only 20%, but these are different types of war. For Israel, the priority now is rockets for building up the Iron Dome. After all, there is a need to produce a large number of rockets because there are a lot of attacks and this exhausts Israel's rocket potential. Then weapons and missiles for aviation are provided also, as well as some other elements of weapons that are not our primary needs. Therefore, in the sense of security assistance, Ukraine and Israel do not overlap much. For example, for Israel, large packages of artillery shells will not be provided because it is a slightly different type of war and they now need something different, says the head of the Center for Military and Legal Studies. As reported on October the 7th, terrorists fired thousands of missiles on Israel from the Gaza Strip. Armed militants entered the homes of civilians, killed women, men and children.